My name is Danica and today I have my TBR for the 24 hour readathon. So tomorrow is one of the days I look forward to all year. It's one of the Dewey's 24 hour readathons and I'm really excited about it so I thought I'd show you some of the books that I'm thinking of reading. First off I'm going to finish the book that I'm currently reading which is Searching for Whytopia. This is a non-fiction book about these all-white little private communities in the U.S. and how they're growing in number and what that means. And it's interesting in parts, but it also meanders a lot. It'll talk about golf, it'll just describe houses for a really long time. So I'm liking it, but not loving it. So hopefully I'm going to read quite a bit of it today so I don't have to spend a lot of time on this during the readathon. And then I have The Deep by Zeta Elliott. This is a young adult, I think, sci-fi book. I don't know a lot about it, but it's short and it's young adult, so it should be a really quick, easy read for when it's either too early or too late for me to be reading comfortably. The other book I'm thinking of reading is Baby G by Abba Dowser. This is the book I'll probably be spending the most time reading during the readathon. It's a full-length novel, but it's been on my list for a long time. I think it's like a lesbian coming-of-age story set in India. I'm really excited about this one, and that should be good for the middle of the readathon. I have Ascension by Jacqueline Koyanegi. This is a sci-fi novel that is queer and diverse, and I've heard only good things about it. And again, since it's a sci-fi novel, I think it should be a quick read for me, and good for when I'm starting to get a little bit tired. And then I have the other Jacqueline Woodson book that I own, which is Autobiography of a Family Photo. This is again a tiny little book. I think it's a children's book, so it should be really quick and easy to read. It's also a lesbian book, so that is always top of my list. So those are the books that I really want to get to during the readathon. I also have some other options, some Sailor Moon manga. I might read these kind of in between if I'm getting tired. I've got a bookmark midway through the third volume because I did read those before, but I've kind of forgotten them, so I might skim or I might read the first three again and then keep going. Another graphic novel I've heard only good things about is A of Yop City. This is the first one in the series, so I'll probably get to this one as well. And a couple more just in case I feel like I want to pick something different up. Resist Essays Against Homophobic Culture. This is a collection of essays, so it might be good to read in little bits. In the Land by Mildred Taylor. This is another young adult children's book. It is quite large though, so I'm not sure. I probably won't get to it this readathon, but just in case. But those are all the books on my readathon pile. I'm definitely not going to read all of them, but hopefully I can get to a good number of them. I'm really excited about it. I hope that lots of you will also be doing it because it's a lot of fun. Let me know if you are, what you're planning on reading. If you've got a TBR video, I'd love to see it. And thank you for watching. Bye!